hello and welcome back so in this class I'm just doing some more things first of all I'm just creating an image well not creating just adding an image to the web page so the source of the image is images slash img one dot jpg so the I images folder is there in the bootstrap now here this is the images folder and this is the img image which I'm just which I just applied so go to the browser again or the notepad again and save that and go to the browser and refresh that one this is the image in the full size okay perfect but the other thing is you can see that uh, it just crossing the uh, container as well but if, if I just apply the class of the bootstrap thumbnail save that and refresh that back now you can see that it is still in the same position which means I have to apply the width of the image as well so width and 2 or 300 px save that and refresh that now the image is very small you can see that now what the thumbnail did you can see if I just remove the thumbnail I'm just showing you without the thumbnail refresh that now you can see the image is in a little full size but when I just apply the thumbnail here refresh that now you can see that a border around the picture can be seen here so the rounded border is it the thumbnail so now if I just go to the notepad and simply duplicate this image and now refresh that one now there are two images so for now instead of the thumbnail I'm applying the IMG circle save that and refresh that one now you can see that this image has a beautiful circle around it this is called the IMG circle so then I can apply there the IMG thumbnail save that and refresh that one now this is the new one version of the thumbnail with the same effect uh, approximately well this is the correct version of the thumbnail this one is not for the images so right now I'm just deleting the first one and duplicating this one and uh, we will learn some more things in the next class so stay tuned and goodbye